Yo, what is up guys? It's Mr. Bear 38 here and today I am bringing you a video I didn't really want to make but we're going to have to get to it. I, What I believe will make Halo great again. So, there's a lot of stuff we're missing in the game. Like, there is so much. I believe we need more things to achieve within Halo such as, you know, like how the old Halo games were. Commendations. Um, progression systems all those stuff and then we've also got the game modes that made Halo Halo so we had game modes such as Assault Juggernaut Territories um, VIP all of them that made Halo Halo as the arena shooter of what it was compared to what we have now um, we're also missing some other key things such as Firefight I don't know why this game does not have firefight at all i wish it did as much as i didn't play firefight that much it was a good break from pvp it would also be great to have like a version of horde mode maybe kind of like firefight but like a gears of war type version of it um like putting up um turrets and defenses and all of that stuff um another major thing we're missing is forge i don't know why we don't have forge like Halo 5 released Forge six months later. Halo Infinite, ever since we got the Season 2 roadmap, it's nearly a whole year without Forge. A whole goddamn year. And not only that, it's still only in beta. It will still be a beta when it comes out. Which I admit I'm not too keen for. Um, something that new shooters do new modern shooters all have a br i used to be strongly against having a battle royale for halo but the more i look at it at the moment i was being selfish but at this current time i would rather the game to have population than no population like i just want halo to thrive that's all i want i want halo to thrive and be better than it's ever been and also some other ways of earning armor outside of the battle pass and outside of the store, such as like the earnable credits that are coming in season two. But we don't know how many credits we are getting and how they're implementing them through challenges or what they have not set. And I hope it's a fair amount because the stuff in the store is pretty, pretty expensive. Um, fixing a lot of issues in the game, such as desync and high ping. That needs to be fixed. Being an Australian, it's miserable playing on 100, 180 ping to 250, if not 400 ping. It is just miserable. It's not fun. It is, it's just not enjoyable whatsoever. I don't think it's enjoyable for anyone to be on that high ping. And now another one. Um, the difference between social and competitive. I don't understand why skill-based matchmaking is in social game. Like, I get it, you got people, the montages that go for clips and all of that stuff, but at the end of the day, there's still those montages and that still need that social break. Skill-based matchmaking should not be in social. It should be in ranked and ranked only and competitive play. That is it. It should not be in anything else but them. Um, Challenges that depend less on someone else, such as kill an enemy when they're on a killing spree. You don't know when someone's on a killing spree, or also having to shoot someone out of the driver's seat of a warthog. That is just... I don't get them challenges. They're not fun, they're not enjoyable, and you don't want to grind for them. And also, hopefully the weeklies are better in Season 2. They've been hyping them up in the blogs. Hopefully they will be better. I'm hoping they will be. I'll have to wait and see. You can't really have a full lobby in Infinite without the game crashing. I want that fixed, or it's just, it's, you can't play with friends. You can't play with friends. That's just how I feel about Infinite. You can't play with friends. It's just broken at a point. And one last thing that I want deeply as an Australian is we need ping limits. Ping limits for service selection. That is all I'm wanting. But that is going to do it for this video, guys. Like, honestly, this is all I want from the game. I want it to thrive. I want Halo to be Halo again. I miss 
getting on, having fun, and just having a great time, you know. I didn't I don't like sweating every single game of my life for this game, but I hope if the game does add a battle royale, it pops off and has a population which brings them back to the arena shooter side of which I love. But we'll have to wait and see and at the moment it's a very it's a long haul but I appreciate you guys honestly for sticking through Halo as fans I know a lot of you are giving up especially with season 2 being another 6 months but I appreciate all you guys much love and I shall see you in the next one